Hi, my name is Adam Bremo, and I'm the founder and CEO of Open Learning. Open Learning is one of the world's leading lifelong learning platforms, and we enable education providers such as universities, colleges, training companies to design and deliver world-class online courses. So we provide the end-to-end -end technology that makes it possible for them to move their programs and courses online and deliver a fantastic experience for students around the world. I launched Open Learning in 2012 with a few other people I knew from the University of New South Wales. So David Collian, our founder and CTO, uh, went to university with me and we both studied computer science and software engineering at UNSW. And Professor Richard Buckland was uh, one of our professors, our lecturers at the time, and is a world-renowned computer science professor. So we got together and we really wanted to build a platform that would increase access to higher quality education. And for us, the focus was really on ensuring that online courses could actually have a very strong community of practice and people could get to know each other, work together, solve problems, and complete a whole range of activities online. And we wanted to create an environment that made that possible. So it could sort of bring together the best of what you could do face to face, but in an online environment where you form community and have a lot more social interaction and project based learning. Open learning is designed for lifelong learners. And really, we're all lifelong learners. Uh, the idea is that, you know, no matter what you studied at university or if you went to university at all, everyone has to upskill and reskill throughout their life and throughout their career. Now, learning happens in many places. You might be learning on the job, you might be learning from a mentor, you might be discovering things on your own. Now, with open learning, the idea is that you'll have access to a whole range of courses that are built and designed by the, some of the world's leading education providers, whether they're independent experts or universities and colleges. Now, for me personally, um, I've always enjoyed going through lots of courses on open learning and seeing the different ways that people are able to use the platform to teach t different new and interesting topics in different ways. So some of the recent courses that I've been really excited about include CS 101, uh, Computer Science 101, which is a Foundations of Computer Science program that we've put together in collaboration with some of the leading technology companies in the world, including Microsoft, Canva, Chronosphere, Alibaba, CT4, and a number of others. And the idea is that you know everyone really needs to learn and develop skills in computer science, computational thinking, programming, and problem solving. But this course does it in a way that makes it more accessible, has a wonderful community, and enables you to complete a whole range of projects and activities, both practical and theoretical. In my undergraduate, I studied software engineering and arts. So I did a double degree at the University of New South Wales. And what I really enjoyed was the cross-disciplinary study, uh, the ability to take a whole range of different courses and get to know people in different fields and faculties. So in my view, universities fulfill a critical role in society. And I think anyone who has the opportunity really would benefit from studying at a university, particularly for their undergraduate program, um, because it provides you with the structure and the depth of uh, programs and knowledge that I think you really need in a lot of fields. Now, that said, um, you know, that's not gonna be the end all and be all of your education experience. It's just the start.